What's up, guys? It's Codex, and we are back with some team fight tactics today. Ooh, there's so many good ones on the battlefield. I'll try it with the Garen today. I don't really know what build I'm going to go with, but I want to try to see what the cards bring out and see what happens. As always, I like to try to bring up my golden bells as quick as possible. Hope everybody's having a fantastic time right now. It's starting to get a little cool where I am. It's changing to the winter season. Oh, I'm still in love with this KDA all out hushtail. Ha! There you go. Nice, Garen. To Katarina's. I'm not really going to complain about that. It's kind of pushing me on a Warlight. Um, Warlord. I said Warlight because I was looking at the Assassin right there. I'm like, ooh, should I? But no. I might even do Assassin. Who knows? But so far, I'm like, uh, it looks like I'm bound to be set up for Warlord. Just because of the Katarina and Garen are out the, right off the hop. While we're doing that. Let's take a quick land. Right we're doing a Moonlight, Duelist, a Brawler. Exile. Okay. A warlord sharpshooter. Sure. So we got warlord uh, first one proc right now. So that's great. We got a Katarina, a Nidalina, and a Garen on the board. That's uh, always good for Needleina. Get some extra attack speed. With Jarvan for Warlord. Okay, okay. Why not? Why not? I know I like to say I like to keep my goal, but we spend a little here, we get an extra tune out. Maybe we can get on that. Um, not losing so hard of a streak quick. <laughs> See, they got a level 2 Nami. Nami is super OP. Love Nami. And I thought they had a pike there for a second, but I wasn't sure. So while Nara, Nami's... Yeah, oh. To say, well, Nami's focus on Jarvan, maybe we can get some out, but no. Oh. Sweet. Was not expecting that. Excellent. We got another one of her, another one of her. Let's see if we can get some more warlords, like I said. Not a bad build. I want to try one out and see how far it actually does. But um, last time, I just wasn't getting it in the rolls. I was sitting on a lot of them. This time, it's feeding me a lot, which is good. So it doesn't look like anybody else is really doing a Warlord build right now. And uh, Katarina is OP. Might be able to throw another fortune. If I do find one with a fortune, too, I might take it just to proc that fortune. Give me some extra gold income, which always helps with leveling up. Oh, Cultus with the Nami. So they'll be losing that Nami eventually, but... But it's going to be GG here for that. Yeah. That cult, this could be uh, pretty OP pretty quick. But we're at the lower end of the board, so that's pretty good for us as well. There we go. Being at the lower end of the board means we will be able to uh, pick first when we go into the share draft next round after our next opponent and we did get our uh, <clears throat> first two star legend 
immediately, so. We'll see what happens. We need to get some more items. And with that, we'll get that in the Krug's combat. I will not falter! Chen oh, okay, maybe not. Yeah. GG. So again, that's not bad, because we, if we get on the bottom half for this next part, yeah, we'll be in the first pick. So, see if we can get a Warlord off the hop. There's a couple of them. Vi, I don't have, though. But there is that blue. I'm going to go for the blue one. Just because he has good armor. I can't remember who he is. He looks like a Jarvan, so I might have made a mistake there. But I do need to pick up a Vi. I'm hoping I'll be able to pick one up. Yeah, see, nobody's even going for Vi, so... She'll be thrown back into the pool, and I'll get a chance at getting her. Just because there's no um, no warlords in there, we're still going to get money. It's just going to be a little bit of a slower climb. And that way we're able to put more people out. Because right now, if I'm able to find one more warlord, hopefully a buy, that'll bring us at warlord six. So that'll be really a bomb for us to have warlord six a little bit early in the game. We're not losing too much health. We are on the bottom end, so we did want that for the choosing, which helped us get... Oh, nice. Our blue guy right down here. Zinjiao. Ooh, look at that arrow just fly. Oh, an enlightened duelist. Unfortunately, I don't really have any other enlightened. And I do have another duelist, but... Not really worth it per se right now. So we're just going to hold on to our gold, our gold and hold on and see what happens. And if we're lucky, maybe we can get another Katarina and make her two star as well. Because I think some of them are getting wise to what I'm doing here. <laughs> oh, a Warwick. That's a nice uh, catch already, a Warwick right there. But that level 2 Fjord, yeah. That was close. <clears throat> still nothing, eh? Well, that's fine. We do still have 5 champions out, so... We'll see what happens after. Yeah, because we might be able to get some items and make some of these guys a little bit more beefy as well. And after all those stages, it'll also trigger this to reroll. Maybe we'll get some more lords in there. We do have our two golden bells, so we'll see what keeps going on. I want to keep triggering that up. I don't want really to want to start rolling yet. I want to get that nice money income going. Does that give you a Damage, yeah, there we go. Gold. There we go, so we got three of those now. Let's see what happens. Keeper, Warlord. There we go. So we got another one of him. So either another one of him or another one of Katarina, and we'll be able to make them level two. Fingers crossed, guys. I know we can do it. Ooh, and Akali. Oh, two star. See, why are they glowing? I don't know why they're glowing. There are war. They are all warlords. Don't they all glow? 
Oh, that enemy, Jarvan. What are you going for, Bob? Oof. Warlord. Ah, there is a... Maybe I should have grabbed that uh, Moonlight. And we know what? We're committed. We're not doing that bad. We are on the bottom, but that just means we're going to be able to pick champions first again. When it comes up to the share draft up here. And there's still a chance for us to get Nidalee or someone else. There's our Vi. Move these guys back a little bit. So after another match or maybe two, I'm hoping just one more, we'll be able to roll into some XP and put Vi out there and trigger Warlord 6. That is one of our goals right now. See if we can pull that off. That top guy is just on fire. I don't think he's lost anything in a while. Who are you? Twist. Ah, the cultists. Nami. Haha. <laughs> Can't stand her. Oh, that Evelyn with that quick attack there. Watch out. Here comes the cultist guy. No. GG. 64. Let's see what happens. Come on, warlords. Actually, no, I don't, I don't really want warlords. I want to be able to roll some experience. Let's see what happens. Ooh, a Jarvan. Worth it. So, we definitely got some starters. And we get one more of any of these guys. These guys will become two-star. And then we need to put Vi out. Which we'll be able to do that again when we get more of our golden bells up here to get more interest on our gold income worth some interest. So passive is, is 5. We got interest max of 4 now. Max was 5. That's with our golden bells is our interest. And our win-loss streak is at a plus 1. After this, if we lose here, which I think we will, we'll be at uh, plus 2. So we'll be getting 11 total income. Yeah. GG. Those cultists are uh, pretty OP. I know. I like cultists. <laughs> so 11, that brings me up to 60. Means I can roll this twice. Bring, I might be able to get to level 6. Oh, and let's see. Any warlords? No, an assassin. No warlords, eh? Which I like Ari. I'm going to grab this guy for the belts. Because my guys need some more um, health. And he also uh, gives the best money because it is a higher tier class. So selling him will be giving me money. I believe that's an Aatrox. So it's a cultist I was able to snag as well. Yeah, Aatrox, Vanguard. Okay. She's a brawler, eh? Yeah. Start spacing these guys out a little bit. Well, I didn't want to buy the XP there. I wanted to actually refresh, but that's okay. We're uh, almost at half-life. We're on the bottom end of the leaderboards right now, but we can still turn this around. We are up against a lot of people playing those cultists now. So I'm kind of glad I didn't go into that pool because they're all fighting for the same cards. So that really opens up a lot of other things for me. But at the same time means I have a lot of cultists to overcome. Oh, I'm just doing their Galio. Yeah. yeah your cultists are not matched for my warlords right now. We turn that around. We're on a win streak a little bit. So that's good. Hmm. Let's see. Ooh, there we go. There's one of them. Fortune Sharpshooter. Oh, Warlord. 
I don't want to hit it because it's going to cost me two. So anything I do do is it's going to bring me down if I have to buy it. So I'm just going to sit here comfortably and wait for the next round. But I was able to upgrade a couple of them. Worked out on our areas. Just get a little bit more spacing. So we'll see what happens. Yeah, Garen has the Rizox portal. So let's see what happens. See if he dies. Oh, I might actually win this. Yeah, there we go. Oh, you can't escape that. That was just a home seeking right there. See, now we're back on our win streak. And we got two star Katarina. So we just need a couple more Katarinas. And again, we're going to stop here because of anything I do have to buy. So we just need a couple more Katarinas. Um, a couple more buys. Oh, here we go. And we are in the item round. So this is also going to help a lot. Maybe if we're lucky. Fortune Sharpshooter. Warlord. I don't know if I was able to trigger either of those in time. So I do have a golden spatula. What do I need for... Warlord. Warlord's banner. Oh, I need the health thing. And I already used it. No! Oh, well. That hair crumb just does not want to die here. There we go. Boom. And boom. There we go. Warlord. Warlord. Who needs a beat down? Who needs a beat down? Ooh, Garen. Ah, poop. Like I said, it's going to bring me down. Is what it is. If we can hang on to the cat, uh, combat against the raptors, then we'll be actually be sitting uh, pretty nice because then we might be able to get a chance to get a Warlord 9. Might. We still don't have the Chosen. Or do we have the Chosen? No, the Chosen's under the Assassin. So no, we won't get the Warlord 9. So I can get something else with um, any of these down here. So we'll keep an eye for things down here. Maybe we can proc something else. We just kick their cultist butt there. Where's all my warlords? Let's see if I can get a couple uh three stars. Three star champions. Three star champions. That's what it's all about, guys. Well, if you want to see some really cool four star champions, you should check out the Team Fight Tactics playlist and look for the uh, Moonlight Godlike, where we have two four-star champions going on. It was an epic, epic video. Lots of fun. You should definitely go check it out. And, oh yeah, we're going to win here. Yeah, because Garen is still like, squishy, I think. I'm not sure exactly how Garen is. I think he might be level two. I think everybody's level two. They are now on fire. Yeah. I'm coming for you. I'm coming for the top. I am climbing my way up there. I bought that golden warlord. Yeah. 
Excellent. Now, I don't know if I can spatula him, like, you know, <laughs> double him something else. I don't know even who he is. He is... He's not not Azir, is he? No. That'd be cool if he was Azir. I don't think he's Azir. Oh, it is Azir. Uh, gains the Warlord trade. So if he already has the Warlord trade, he's not going to gain anything. Okay, okay. Oh, that was great. Look at that. I think it's the Emperor trait. Place two sand guards. Place anywhere on the battlefield. Did not move or did not move or attack and die when their Emperor does. They're just kind of like decoys there, I believe. So. And he has range. Ooh, that Evelyn is a little uh, OP there. With that hex. That Evelyn. Oh, so close. Oh, I'm, I was close. I was getting worried there. That Evelyn was just tearing through everybody. Any warlords in here? I'm looking for a warlord. Sir, please, more warlords. I'm going to put this one right here. Yeah. I should stop whoever's trying to get him. He'll kind of like wander out after. I'm just worried about assassins getting them. See... Do I have any other mages? I don't have any other mages. Am I getting... I have all the warlords. I have the one emperor. I'm hoping I get more of him. He'll start popping up more now that we have 1% in our um, higher tier stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, he has one of him. A set. Oh, no. Was enough. Sorry. Not enough push-up set. Push-up, sit-ups, tomato, tomato. <laughs> These guys are just really hating life. Okay, another warlord. Warlords. Divine hunter brawler. What am I doing? What am I stopping for? Nope. A lot of fortunes coming into play right now. Oh, here we go. So... I might be able to put an extra class on somebody here, depending on what gets popped out. So far, I see a mage. I see. I do see the warlord. What does this do? Assassin. Okay. So I could get another assassin out there. Okay. He definitely needs more health. Uh, any more warlords? It's got to be quick. And if I miss anything, whoops. So still nothing. I don't see anything I can use for that um, golden spatula yet. Like I said, maybe a sharpshooter. Surprise, aha, just took that dry. I want a win streak of 8, so my golden comes 13 right now, so that's definitely not bad. Ooh, Tormented Shade. No, Warlord. Oops, went too far. 
<laughs> Just, whoops, one too far. Ooh, Jarvan. Not sure where we are on those guys. I gotta take a look. Okay, I got two Jarvins. I got a Vi. I got a Needly. I really need an Emperor. So I might start selling some of these guys back and just really focus on the Vi. Anything Garen? There's a Vi right there. Yeah, maybe you just Vi and Garen and hope I can start rolling up and start getting some more Emperors. Because I only have 1% chance of getting him. I need to be higher level. And I could probably start putting some of these fuller guys, like these extra two stars, on the field as well. Why not, actually? Put a Vi there. Here, Vi, there, Vi, everywhere, Vi, Vi. And gives me a higher chance to get something else. I just tanked a lot of my gold. But because I'm on a win rate, I'm going to get that up like really quick as I go up high and higher and higher. So I just got to have trust that that will help me having that extra two star out there. That buy. That Katarina is just deadly. <laughs> And boom! Oh, I love that animate that death animation. Oh, I want that Lindsay. Oh no, I'm like first pick or last pick. Okay, okay. Lisa. No, he went for Lisa. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Okay. Uh, item now. Item now. Infinity Blade. That's one of the things that sucks when you're last pick. Is if like you really kind of want something. Like, oh, I gotta get it. I gotta get it. Yeah, you might not get it. <laughs> so I, like I said, wanted the Infinity Blade. What is this doing? So I'm gonna put it on her. And we're gonna. Kinda, because we are on a hot streak. We got some health. We're gonna see what happens when we face Ringu up, or yeah, Riangu up there, and just cool it with some of these guys. We're not gonna do some rolls. We're gonna let our money rebuild back up, and hopefully we can get up to the Nexus minion. Ooh, that guy looks beefy. Yeah, so this is the top star guy right now. We'll see what happens. Oh yeah, that there's that Evelyn. Okay. So that Evelyn is definitely needing to be some work on. There's another Vi. I need to get one more Vi. She'll be a three star. Hmm. Yeah, I can just sit and wait. Hopefully, I don't go up against that guy again in the near future. Let me build up my. Yeah, okay, it's way, way. Oh. Does he, have an, does he have an annoying Evelyn too? <laughs> or is it just the other one that was annoying? Yeah, I didn't know this guy's easy sauce. Boom. Oh no, he got. He's the guy that. He's just gonna at least send me us all out of here. Okay, so we're probably going to take third here because I don't think I can defeat those cultists. And I definitely don't think I can uh, defeat that two-star Lee Sin right now. So we're going to do some hard rolls. Um, hmm. 
Who can I put out as filler? Whatever, I'll put a Garen out as filler. You know what? Why not? I'll give you a spatula. Okay, so you'll do that pretty quickly. Pull that off. Ooh, a yawn. Exile, adapt. Hmm. No, I went with the sleepy time, just because it's more defensive. Ooh, piece of gold. Piece of gold. Okay. Whew. This is like the pinch right now. Like, I really need to make sure. Come on. on. Ezreal? No, I'm not going to add an Ezreal in there. Zillion Ezreal? Okay, maybe I should have. Fuck me, maybe I should have. Like, there's three as Like, what the heck? There's another Azir, finally. Oh, this is just... Sleepy time! <laughs> But with that knock back up, will it be enough? No, nah, this is Tiangu. I don't think so. Not with that. Ooh. Boom. Well, I'm not out yet. I'm at 19. There's a... Oh, another... Yo no, that's... That's Yone. Sealed Fate. Oh, I thought I'd try. I don't think this is going to work out well for me. I could take them out, but I like the Sleepy for her, and he does a really good effect on himself, so... <clears throat> this is way, way. Oh, yeah, at least in way, way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that doesn't even matter. Oh, 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 I got the least sin out. What? Nice. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Whoa, okay, this is going to be great. Top, th top three. Let's see what happens. Battle for the top three. Any, oh, I really want to put this Lee Sin out. You know what? Lee Sin must do something, right? Damn. I know I'm not going to, like, get another one of those guys right now. It's too far late in the game. I'm just really hoping to get another Azir. Come on. Play it out nice like last time. I don't even know what's going on up here. 
Now, oh, nice. Okay. No, I was gonna say if the god, if the gods liked me, they'd give me another Azir. But the gods don't like they don't love me today. So this is where this is where it's gonna show. Let's see what happens. I I don't even know. Like so close. So close. Like... With all the different effects and stuff that's going on, I... I... I don't even know right now what's going on. No. And is that it? That is it! GG, guys. GG. Second place. Ah. Oh. That was... That was great. That, that was cool. Well, guys. At, at the end of that, like I said, we had a three-star Katarina, a three-star Vi, a two-star Zin Zhao, two-star Garvin, two-star Garen, two-star Nidalina. We got a one-star Zir and a one-star star Lee Sin. Like... That was great. That cultist, that was really hard build uh, to try to go up against, but that was really lots of fun to do. If you guys liked today's video, make sure you uh, hit the like button, hit subscribe if you want to stay up to date on everything that uh, I post. You post almost every night, sometimes twice a day. Make sure you hit that notification bell. And guys, I will see you in the next game. Have a good one.